Hey, you've got an M1911A1. Yeah, a 45. 50 years since the army adopted the first model and they're still using them. It's a real gem of an automatic pistol. But aren't you going to need more than just one little handgun? Not at all. When you're in a tight spot or fighting in close quarters, sometimes a handgun works better than a rifle. And if I equip a knife at the same time, I can instantaneously switch over to hand-to-hand -to -hand combat. I see. That 45 you've got there is a lot different from the original, though. Looks like someone did some serious work on it. It's more than a little. First of all, the feeding ramp is polished to a mirror sheen. It's not going to have any feeding problems. The slide's been replaced with a reinforced version, and it meshes perfectly with the frame. The frame itself has been iron welded and scraped down multiple times for maximum precision. The front strap part of the frame has been checkered to make it dig into the hand. That prevents any slipping. The sight system's original too. It's a three dot type. It's got an enlarged front sight, giving it superior target sighting capability. The regular hammer has been replaced with a ring hammer. That enhances the cocking control and increases the hammer down speed. They also reworked the grip safety to accommodate the ring hammer. Looks like they eliminated it altogether. This is a tool for pros. The thumb safety and the slide stop are extended to allow for more precise handling. The base of the trigger guard is whittled down so you can use a high grip. And the trigger itself is a long type for easy finger access. The trigger pull is about 3.5 pounds. That's about a pound and a half lighter than normal. The magazine well has been widened to make it easier to put in a new magazine. The magazine catch button has been cut down low to make it harder to hit it by mistake. The mainspring housing has been changed to a flat type to increase grip. And it's even been fitted with stepping so it doesn't slip from the recoil when firing. On top of that, they added cocking serrations to the front part of the slide. That lets you load and eject cartridges faster in an emergency. Whoever did this is a professional. No question, this thing could shoot a one hole at 25 yards in a machine rest. Well, I'll be damned. That's some gun. Yeah, I've never used a weapon this fine in my life. <laughs>